Hi, I'm Jeannie and I'm here from Jimmy Bean's Wall and I want to talk to you about yarn overs. Um, we've done a basic video about yarn overs and how you do that in the middle of your work and create lace and decreasing and increasing with yarn overs. Um, but there's a technique that creates a lovely edge and you can use it to pick up stitches later or just to leave as an edge in lace knitting. And that's a yarn over at the beginning of a row. And it can be a little intimidating at first. And you'll notice that I'm holding up um, a lovely pattern that we've had a great response to, Jared Flood's Rock Island Shawl. You can see our review about it at that um, place on our website. You can see it's just gorgeous big yarn overs. What I will tell you about this particular pattern is it starts at the edge, which is what I have here, and then later you're going to pick up those um, yarn overs that we're going to do at the front of the row that I'm going to show you to pick up the body of the shawl and work your way up into that um, triangle. So it's a really actually quite an older knitting lace technique to do the edge first and then pick up the body of the shawl and work the triangle in increases. So I'm really excited. I'm having a lot of fun. I've learned some new things already. Thank you, Jared. So I'm going to set the pattern down and really teach you how to do the uh, do a yarn over at the beginning of the row. And the way he designed this pattern, here's Shimon. Let's use the pattern to kind of highlight because I'm using dark yarn. The color of this is the Grand Street Ink, which is his color commentary from Lorna's Laces. And if you look, you can see these loops right here. Those are the yarn overs at the front of the row. Um, and you do it every single right side row. You yarn over and knit two together every single time. And later he's going to have us come back in and pick up these stitches, uh, these lovely yarn overs, which are nice and loose and going to make it really easy to pick up. So I'm just going to quickly show you how to do this yarn over at the front of the row. And it really is very simple. Just like any other yarn over, you bring that to the front of your work. So how I'm working this is I kind of leave my yarn hanging here. I am a right-handed knitter, so I do carry my yarn in my right hand. I will get ready with my knit two together here. Then I bring my yarn up and around my needle like this and work that yarn over. So you can see I have that yarn over stitch here at the front of the work and this stitch that is created two out of one is my knit two together. And Siobhan, if you'll stay right there, I'll take this apart and show them one more time. That's a great angle. Isn't Siobhan the best videographer? I just love working with her. So how I, whoops, Oh gosh, lace mistake. Okay, there we go. So how I start doing this is I do my knit two together. I have my yarn hanging loose and free and just bring it up and over that needle. Again, up and over that needle and knit those two stitches together and I now have two stitches where they're well, I have a yarn over at the beginning. I was going to say two stitches where there was one, but there really was two, and oh gosh, you know, you can do it. But this creates that lovely yarn over at the very beginning of the row, which later we're going to be picking up. Boy, this is dark yarn, isn't it? It's lovely. It's so rich, hence the ink name. You can see those yarn overs there on my finger, just kind of like a scalloped edge. And it does. It creates a lovely edge for pattern. Or um, And what was the name of that shawl? The Hydrangea Cowl in Brave New Knits. Yeah, that had yarn overs at the beginning of the work. So have fun. Learn something new. Lace really isn't as scary as you think. We have a lot of fun with lace around here. Uh, enjoy. Do it. Give it a try. Why not? Have fun knitting. I'm Jeannie from Jimmy Bean's Wool, and we're talking about yarn overs at the beginning of your row. Bye!
Thunder rumbles on this American summer night There's kids on the corner Stuck in a switchblade fight And the rock and roll bands Play for 